In the United States, the 1920s was a time of bold sexual experimentation. Snuggle pupping, necking, spooning, no matter what you called it, young men and women were getting together and trying new things. Known as petting parties, these gatherings could be indoors or outdoors. They could be planned or happen spontaneously, but they were always about sexual pleasure. Participants could kiss, fondle, and essentially do anything that didn't involve penetration at a petting party. For the men and women who participated, it was a way to experience sexual pleasure without the risks of pregnancy or sexually transmitted diseases. But for the traditional-minded, these parties, along with jazz, dancing, and cigarette-smoking women, were the epitome of the moral decay they saw as dangerous to society. These scandalous parties mostly died out by the 1930s. Rumors say they still happen to this day. Now, many of us are unaware that 